this is Natasha Tracy for Breaking Bipolar at HealthyPlace.com. Today's article is about psychiatric medication and weight gain. As many people know, many types of psychotropic medication do cause weight gain. Primarily, this is antipsychotics, although antidepressants are also known to cause weight gain. Some medications are particularly prone to doing it, and some medications are explicitly not prone to producing weight gain. So it really depends on which medication that you're actually taking as to how likely it is that you'll actually gain weight. However, in my case, I've been on many of the medications that are prone to making someone gain weight. And I can tell you that one of the biggest mistakes that I made was actually not tracking my weight when I was on these medications. I'm not prone to tracking my weight because I tend to get a bit obsessive about that sort of thing, which isn't very healthy for me, so I just try to avoid it altogether. I suppose I'm also trying to avoid the unpleasantness of such things. So when I started different medications, I also didn't track my weight at that time. It was pretty surprising to me that I was on medications that were so prone to weight gain and my doctor actually wasn't tracking my weight. That also made me think that it wasn't a big concern. However, this was a mistake on my part. I should have taken more responsibility over what that particular medication was doing to my body. I should have tracked it more carefully because quite frankly, by the time I figured out that I was gaining weight, it was a little on the late side. I had gained quite a bit of weight by that time. The doctor hadn't said anything. I hadn't thought about it. I was in a bit of denial, I suppose. And so before I knew it, I had gained a lot of weight. And of course, with weight gain, it's much easier to put on weight than it is to take off weight. So it's something that you definitely want to avoid up front if you can. But I think that one of the stumbling blocks is when you're taking this type of medication, it's because you're really not doing well in the first place. And taking that medication to try and get better it kind of takes up all of your effort and all of your energy in and of itself. And so worrying, some, worrying about something like a side effect that may or may not happen is just too much stress for you to worry about. And this is completely understandable. But the problem is with these medications, the problems build up over time. And before you know it, you've got a problem on your hands. Additionally, blood tests to check things like blood sugar, triglyceride levels, um, cholesterol, that sort of thing should be taken um, when you're on these kinds of medications and sometimes that's not done by doctors either and patients need to stay on top of that because not only then could possibly their weight be creeping up, which they can actually track easily with a scale, um, it could be that numbers in your blood are also tracking in unfortunate ways, but this is an invisible problem and something that you won't know until your annual physical or until the problem really gets out of control. So blood tests are really important. So even though it's quite stressful to have to worry about these additional concerns with psychiatric medication, if you worry about them now, you will have few worries later. And that's basically the gist of it and how you need to think about it. A little bit of stress now, much less stress later. I'm Natasha Tracy and this is Breaking Bipolar.